In this exercise, we'll be working with rational expressions. The directions tell us to perform the indicated operations and simplify. In this case, the indicated operations are subtraction and addition. In order to add and subtract rational expressions, we need to have a common denominator. In order to find the least common denominator, we need to factor the denominators. x plus 1 is already in factored form, so is x minus 1, but we can factor x squared minus 1. So we rewrite the problem. We have 1 over x plus 1 minus x plus 2, and we'll write this denominator in factored form as x plus 1 times x minus 1 plus 3 over x minus 1. The denominators are now x plus 1, x plus 1 times x minus 1, and x minus 1. The least common multiple of the denominators is x plus 1 times x minus 1. So in order to get each of these expressions with that denominator, I will multiply the first expression times x minus 1 over x minus 1. The second expression already has that denominator, so I'll just copy it down. It's x plus 2 over x plus 1 times x minus 1. The third expression, I need a factor of x plus 1 in the denominator, so I will multiply 3 over x minus 1 times x plus 1 over x plus 1. Now I need to do those multiplications. Multiplying here, 1 times x minus 1 is x minus 1. And since I'm going to have a common denominator all the way across, I'll combine the numerators as I go. Now I subtract the numerator x plus 2. Be careful whenever you subtract to use parentheses. So this is minus, using parentheses, the quantity x plus 2, plus, and now I multiply 3 times x plus 1, and that is all over the common denominator x plus 1 times x minus 1. Now I need to see what I can do with simplifying in the numerator. The numerator is x minus 1, and then I take out the parentheses and write minus x minus 2, and then I can multiply 3 times x plus 1 and get plus 3x plus 3. And all that is over the denominator x plus 1 times x minus 1. Now I need to combine like terms. I have an x, uh, opposite of x, and a 3x, and that simplifies to 3x. I have negative 1 minus 2 plus 3, which is 0. So the numerator is 3x, and the denominator is x plus 1 times x minus 1. Since I can't factor the numerator or the denominator any further, and since there are no common factors, this is the simplified form of the expression.